Selfish was the first song, first of all, that I've ever written, and the first day we wrote it, I was like, this is something special. I knew, like, right away. Um, and it's basically kind of about being with someone, and you're so selfish of, like, their time and, like, who they hang out with and who they're around, and you just, you just, you want all their affection, like, all the time. And I think anybody who's in, like, a new relationship, you know, can relate to that. You may or may not be aware of this. I have heard the ladies love you. What do you look for in a future sort of, like, dedicated partner? What's a uh, person need to have? Trust. You writing this down, guys? Okay. Tr <laughs> trust. Um, they, got, they have to be funny and they have to have a good sense of humor because I joke around 90% of the time. Would you ever date a fan? Bigger question. Yeah, of course. I think, like, why Like, why wouldn't you? Right. If someone, you know, feels that way about your music and feels that way about you, like, that's, you're halfway there. There you go. A true man of the hair singer Spencer Sutherland has been making all his lady fans swoon with his soulful voice and catchy tunes. Selected as Elvis Duran's July Artist of the Month, the 24-year-old musician has been killing the game with his hit single Selfish, and that's why it's our Toyota People Pick of the Day. Now, while the performer clearly loves all of his fans, there are some encounters that, let's just say, really stick out. Watch this. There's been a few, but one that just sticks out in my mind about how, like, how much I meant to someone, which is, you know, they mean to me a lot, but it was crazy, is this girl lived in Atlanta, and I was at my parents' house in Ohio, and she drove all the way up to my house. Oh my God. I don't know how she knew the address, I don't know how she knew, like, where it was, but. Showed up. Got back from a run, and she was there. And did you call the cops, or did you guys just have a nice conversation? She left. <laughs> I don't know which way this goes. We uh, we had a nice conversation. We took some pictures, and um, she she left. Wow, isn't that crazy? I was pretty cool with it. It was a little bit like, whoa, how'd you know? Yeah. My mom was a little bit freaked out. I'm sure. Yeah. I was like, don't like, don't worry. They know I'm in LA. Yeah. Have fans got you any crazy gifts? Have they made anything for you? Yeah, I've got some cool stuff. I've yeah. gotten a custom hat. Oh. I've gotten custom vans. Okay. I got, this is so crazy, but I got a $500 gift card. <laughs> I know. We love you so much. Why don't you enjoy some Amazon products? I like didn't know what to do with it. I was like, I'm not like, I don't know.